Well, do you remember yesterday? Yes, I'm walking in the river. You remember yesterday when I was doing the tugboat video, and I said, and I don't even know if I have my head cam rolling uh, on that one. Well, I'll find out when I get home. I got a couple good, I got about a whole tank out of Vader. I'll put uh, a little bit of that up on the deck cam. But again, stock tuning, nothing fancy. And I don't know if it's on the camera or not. <laughs> I'm sure it is, because I had the deck cam going. I don't know about this one. Uh, I'm running, and it's running fairly well. And I slowed down a little bit. And the boat launches out of the water and crashes, submerses, just goes totally underwater, and then sinks. And it's like this, the bow is floating, because I got flotation in there, but as you can see, it's only like three feet deep here. Do you guys remember yesterday when I said, there's a reason I run my boats over there? See where it's real deep? See those little waves over there? I don't know if you can see them in the camera. Look how shallow it is. See my knees? Look what I fucking hit. With my brand new boat on the Maiden, I hit a tire. <laughs> I can't believe my luck. Look at that piece of shit. Took out my Vader. Now, look how shallow it is. Not super wise to be running in this depth of water to begin with. But, again, that's why I said yesterday, there's a reason I run over there. Over there, it's over my head. And that's where I usually run my boats. I did not see this, because there's no way you could have. Um, but, yeah. So, the good thing is, the only thing it screwed up on Vader... Uh, besides soaking the whole damn thing, we didn't need a bath anyway, was it bent my stuffing box. So the shaft tube, instead of coming down real nice, is like bent up. No big deal. Didn't hurt the shaft, didn't hurt the prop. Luckily, I launched. I think I hit this tire and launched right off, and uh, no harm done, really. I can fix the stuffing tube issue. Um, I'll just brace a new one on. But, uh, yeah, maiden run, I hit a fucking tire. Are you kidding me? So I'm actually going to get this tire out of here so that doesn't happen to anybody else or myself. I think I'm the only one that actually runs over here. And I might go get my outrigger and give that a day in court too, my gas rigger I brought too, because I'm just a glutton for punishment. But that first run, even though it was all stock settings and everything on that carb, I did not hate it. I really didn't. Uh, it was running really good. I was right. I have a little bit too much nose weight. Not a lot. I think it was planing okay, but I need to adjust my strut, obviously. Um, the hull's running real wet for a hydro. But again, I wasn't going full speed. I did have a digital tachometer in there, so we will. I'm going to do a video on that tonight. We'll see what the actual tack range was. Um, but all in all, for not setting up the hull and not even tuning the engine yet, it really didn't run too hateful. So I might go get that stick out too while I'm here. So until the next time, kids, <laughs> don't hit tires. Uh, keep the wet side down. Take care. Bye.